Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome again to Channel 48, and thank you for tuning in on this Sunday evening. Well, I'm here with my Samsung Galaxy S5, because one of my Android soldiers told me that Android 14 was released for the S5. And we're gonna go ahead and install it and see how it works. Developer responsible for this work is Mr. Carl Fatt. So let's jump into it and see what this ROM is all about. We are also finding this phone. I went through three bags, but <laughs> it was right here on my desk, hiding in this thing. Suddenly I remember that I had it in this, in this thing. So let's do a formatting of the data, yes. And reboot back into recovery. And copy the file once again. This one can go into its casing. This is the Neo. I break it now. Reboot. Power off. Do not install. Okay, so this one can go in the back. We don't need it. And this will be the Linux OS downloads. Copy. Paste. Almost there. So let's take a look at the Twerp version. This is Twerp 3.6. Could be that we must update, but should install fine. Okay, there we go. We're installing Android 14 Revolutionary, built by Calvat. He brought Android 14 to the S5, the KLTE, and to some other models. I saw two other models, so I will as well put those in the description. So you guys can go ahead and test out Android 14. I did not read no manual, so could be that we need to do a hard reset during the reboot to make it boot. Could, but it's not sad to be that way. So we're just gonna reboot and see what's gonna happen. The S5 has a long boot delay. but it should start booting anytime from now. And a great big up to Kalfat for do his, doing his thing, you know, Android 12, 13, 14, all downloadable from SourceForce now. So SourceForce is as well blessed to have this file. Because I think many people still have the S5. It's an old phone, but a great phone to have if you have the G900F. That is this device, the international model. Then you can as well install Android 13 to it. And the upgrade is in fact very simple. There is no um unlock, and if there is, turn it on in developers options. Put the phone into a download mode, flash twerp to it. Reboot after that into twerp. So there was no boot delay, it booted up very, very fast, even faster than Android 13. So compliments for that, Mr. Kalfat. Very beautiful. And I think many people will now really hit their head that they sold their S5. I got this one, by the way, from Gerjan. And Gerjan I met on Marketplace and yeah, he had the S5 Mini for sale. And he was selling it with, uh, 
with lineages. So I contacted him. I said, hey, well done, bro. To sell with lineages. I'm not looking for mini. I'm looking for, you know, KOTE. He said, I still have one. You can pick it up free. So I went to pick it up. And since then, I have this phone again. Because I had the KLTE. But I gave it to my mom. And when she passed away, the thing as well died. So, yeah. <sighs> so that device just quitted at a certain moment on me. And I as well lost it. I think S5 users can be so proud if they still can do this. If you still have the device. So let's take a look at the camera if it works. This aperture. Ap aperture. I always see it wrong. You can make a picture. Selfie camera. Am I doing something wrong? Video. Selfie. Oh, of course. My selfie camera is blocked. You don't see nada. But then we should see some black. It's not really switching. So, mic on, nice, 30 frames per second, 1080p recording, so you can s switch by tapping it, nice, so you can as well make smaller recordings, but I think selfie is not working, that's what I think, let's see if the video works. Testing, one, two, three, four, five. All right, let's see if we can find the video. Go into gallery. Can't play this video. Okay, we'll have to look into that. Okay, so, yeah, don't depend too much on video for now. Maybe it needs another camera to work even better. But you can make pictures, as you can see. So that works. Yes, I me. So I think it should, it should work. No network, my, my SIM card is, is old. So yeah, Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi works. Let me connect. Connecting and we have an IP. So, Internet. Seems to work fine. YouTube. We can skip. Yes, 50 best keepers on the whole world still after my last one. The Tifo is not normal. The first one I'm going to ask is no one more than Paulo. That's it. It plays. 
That's one of my Dutch uh, colleagues. He don't mind that I use this video to show you that this works. That's a cool guy. Um, yeah, music. We have a nice player on board. Recorder. Testing one, two, three, four, five. Works good. Not that good as my recorder, but it's okay. Um, and then I am talking about audio recorder from F Droid. It's the best recorder. We should adapt that recorder. I adapted it already in my payrooms. So uh, yeah, guys, uh, a nice Lineage OS build. Uh, you would not believe it, but it's for your Samsung Galaxy S5, the KLTE in this case. And the other models are as well listed in the description, so check it out. I will as well put the link to this ROM, okay? So you can as well go ahead and download it if you have the S5 or any of the other supported models. I say thank you very much, Kalfat, and... Amazing work. I feel that this ROM is even better than the Android 13 ROM just for the camera not working yet. But, you know, this is a development that just started, was just released. I think soon we will get a new build, you know, and uh, just like Android 13, uh, the next to come up for the S5 is now Android 14 and that on Sunday the 14th. Of course, if you're gonna install gaps uh, to the device, uh, to this ROM, then you, if you grab a big package, you might get a complete pixel experience, including the widgets and all these things that uh, you can get. Uh, I'm gonna keep it uh, on vanilla. I like vanilla. And I as well gonna see how my pair will look on Android 14 on the S5. And how it works with the other applications gonna see if the camera can be fixed maybe with open camera we'll have to see about that but for now i can say it's there android 14 for your samsung galaxy s5 international model code name klte and the two other models and uh, i'm very happy to see that uh, i was as well asked to make a review about uh, the S9 that as well received Android 14 One UI 6. I'm, I think I already downloaded it. Uh, yeah, when you asked me what was his name, Johnny X, Johnny S, and me said, Bug Android One UI 6. I said, I'm not interested. He said, Why? Well, I'm busy with a lot of other things as well. I'm kind of busy these last days. So, um, I'm trying to find time once in a while to make a video um, just like today and yeah I hope you liked this video if you like the video and the development leave this video a thumbs up and of course uh, if you did not subscribe yet feel free to subscribe it's completely free and uh, commenting to the video always brings a good uh, vibe under the video so people can as well talk about the experience having Android 14 on their Samsung Galaxy S5. This was it. Have a beautiful Sunday with your family or if you're alone, stay tight. Uh, ja bless and see you or you'll be seeing me in the next video again. Until then, bye bye.